Thank you. Hi, uh, congratulations. Uh, we're going to make sure to get out there and get some food, some soul food. Um, but I, I'm very uh, concerned. I'm, the, I'm Kim Bailey Turo. I'm the publisher of Las Vegas Black Image. And um, I'm a graduate of Spelman College in Atlanta. And, um, and I see so many of our people in our community literally dying because of our diet and what we're eating. I, I wanted to pose a question to Glory Foods, but they kind of got off the stage. I mean, the greens are delicious, but if you ever look at the sodium content, it, it, it's, it's really, really high. And I was just wondering, with your restaurant, uh, what, what position are you taking with just trying to make sure that it tastes good, but I'm not going to kill you? <laughs> I, we we um, we first of all one of the things that kills a lot of is is the fact that a lot of pork we use mostly turkey we usually I believe that um, onions and peppers are are still the natural vegetables are still the best to season food we also have a variety of not just what we call soul food but we also offer salads we also offer raw seafood tilapia different types of things but we believe consciously that we do vegetable platters so we're not just we're a soul food restaurant, but we offer a diversity, mm -hmm. and we make sure that we, we consciously think of people's health. Uh, with the oils in which we use, we make sure that there are no allergic oils, and we make it known, and fatty oils, and we make sure that we, we try to cook the food healthy so that we can remain healthy and still come back and not cause problems for yeah. us. Yeah. Okay, we have a couple more questions for you all. And thank you for bringing them down. That was one or more. I got <laughs> I just wanted to know how you came up with the names, a term that we've been using for like decades, centuries. How did y'all come to turn, you know, market that? And then my second part of my question, I wanted to ask you, uh, I love your brand of comedy. Well, how do you describe it? You know what I'm saying? So, <laughs> Mama Nails is just, I was thinking, and I actually came by just actually a prayer. I just prayed and said, God, what, what do you want me to have? Call this restaurant. And I thought about when I'm hungry, he said, call the restaurant Mama Nims. Because most times when we're hungry, Mama people yeah. say, where you going? I'm going to Mama Nims. So that's, that's, that's just how it came about. I mean, yeah. um, English, you want us to spell it in English? <laughs> M-A-M-A-N-E-M-S. I tell you, I've never, um, you clown it. I love that. But Mama Nims, we just came up with it. I know it's slang, but that's the best way you could come yeah. Where are you from again? Yeah. Orlando, Florida. We, we, we're located right now from Universal Studios. We have a complex and our restaurants in that complex. Right now, Family Feud. Right? Yes. Yeah. Shout out to Family Feud. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, I'm sorry. Yeah. Well, my brand of comedy comes from the heart. I talk about what's on my mind. I don't leave nothing out. And that's basically how you break... You know, life is funny, and I talk about my life, and I share, you know, and I mean, he keeping it real with Mama Nell. I mean, we say that every day. I say fix the go and Mama Nell, and, uh, <laughs> you know, do she, you know, all, you know, we add, we add words to words that don't need no words added to them, you know, but I just keep it real, because, you know, I come from that core. I'm from St. Louis, Missouri, the Midwest, you know. So, I mean, but I'm on stage, I just love to make people laugh. Not think hard, but like, like you're saying, when you scare people about Aww. how you eat. My granddaddy ate pork shoulder for almost 75 years, then he ate it once. It's just the other chemicals they putting in the animal that's killing folks. Let's keep it real. <laughs> <laughs> it ain't the salt. <laughs> a little salt saves your life sometimes. Keep that gold off your neck. <laughs> you know? <laughs> <laughs> No, that's what I do. I just like you. I think people need to laugh, especially nowadays, and I like to share with everybody. And God gave me this talent, and I just do it. What do you got going on in terms of projects, movies, uh, books, whatever? Oh, well, I have a sitcom pilot I got to deal with, Comedy Central. Uh, me and Ralphie May, you know, we, matter of fact, we opened up a barbecue restaurant called... Uh, Big Big Daddy's hot uh, hot damn uh, barbecue, and uh, we were in hair. We found out we were brothers, and uh, we both got the same father. And uh, the comedy ensues. It's gonna be on Comedy Central debut probably in February. Right now in script, so you, we got the deal. Everything's done with that. Plus, I have an hour special on filming in my hometown, October the twenty third. In St. Louis, Missouri, called the Bell coming, the Bell coming home. So it's my first hour special in my hometown. So look for that on your DVD everywhere. Okay, right. we have one more question from the floor. Hey, this is Dwayne Thompson with Against the Grain Magazine.